गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स योर फर्स्ट पेपर इज एडवांस्ड एब्सट्रैक्ट एल्जप्रा एंड टुडे वी विल स्टार्ट सेक्शन वन आवर फर्स्ट टॉपिक इज कॉम्यूटेटर्स लेट अस डिफाइन द कॉम्यूटेटर ऑफ एन ऑर्डेड पेयर ऑफ एलिमेंट्स इन अ ग्रुप सो लेट अस टेक जी इज अ ग्रुप एंड वी टेक टू एलिमेंट्स एक्स एंड वाई बिलोंगिंग टू दिस ग्रुप जी Now, because x belongs to group G, so x inverse is also an element of G, and y belongs to G implies that y inverse is also an element of group G. So we can form an element x inverse, y inverse, x y, which is again an element of group G, and this element is called the commutator of the ordered pair formed by the elements x and y. and it is denoted by uh, the symbol x comma y enclosed in square brackets now let us discuss some of the properties of commutators so the first property is inverse of a commutator is again a commutator let us take two elements x and y from a group g and then by definition of commutator the commutator of these two elements x and y is defined by the element x inverse y inverse x y now let us find the inverse of this commutator so by definition inverse of the commutator of the elements x and y that is given by inverse of the element x inverse y inverse x y now by definition of inverse this is given by y inverse into x inverse into the inverse of y inverse into the inverse of x inverse so this element will become y inverse x inverse y x and by definition this is the commutator of y with x so we have proved that the inverse of the commutator of elements x and y is equal to the commutator of y with x in the next property we prove that conjugate of a commutator is again a commutator if we take an element x belonging to a group g then its conjugate is given by g inverse xg where g is also an element of group g similarly for y belonging to group g its conjugate is defined by the element g inverse yg now let us find the conjugate of the commutator formed by the elements x and y with respect to g and we proved that it is given by the commutator of conjugate of x with conjugate of y now in order to prove this let us take g is a group x and y are elements from the group g and g is also an element of group g now let us find the conjugate of the commutator of elements x and y now by definition of conjugate this is given by g inverse into the commutator of x with y into g now by definition commutator of x with y this is given by x inverse into y inverse into xy now we can write this expression again by using gg inverse in place of identity now g inverse into x inverse here we can insert identity and that can be written as g into g inverse and again y inverse into here again we have inserted identity which can be written as g into g inverse and here also Uh, in between x and y we have inserted g into g inverse now this whole expression can be written as g inverse into x inverse into g into g inverse into y inverse into g into g inverse xg into g inverse yg now this element is the inverse of the element g inverse xg this element is the inverse of g inverse yg so we have obtained by definition this is the commutator of the elements g inverse xg and g inverse yg now by definition g inverse xg 
that is the conjugate of element x g inverse phi g that is the conjugate of element phi so we have proved that conjugate of the commutator of elements x and y is given by the commutator of conjugate of x with conjugate of y now next we prove some of the commutator identities let us take g is a group if we take three elements x y and z from this group then the commutator of x y with z is given by the product of the conjugate of commutator of x and z with respect to y into the commutator of y with z in order to prove uh, this identity let us start from right hand side let us consider the conjugate of commutator of x with z into the commutator of y with z now by definition of conjugate this is given by y inverse into the commutator of x with z into y and into the commutator of y with z by definition commutator of x with z that is given by x inverse into z inverse into x z commutator of y with z that is given by y inverse into z inverse into y z now from here we can see that we can combine these two terms y into y inverse that will become identity so this expression reduces to y inverse into x inverse into z inverse into x into z into z inverse into y z now again z into z inverse that is identity so we get y inverse into x inverse into z inverse into x y z now y inverse x inverse this is the inverse of x y so this expression reduces to x y whole inverse into z inverse into x y z by definition this is the commutator of the element x y with z so we have proved one of the commutator identities now the second is we are to prove that the commutator of x with yz is equal to the product of commutator of x with z and the conjugate of the commutator of x and y with respect to z again let us start from the right hand side so let us consider the commutator of x with z into the conjugate of commutator of x and y with respect to z now by definition of conjugate this can be written as z inverse into the commutator of x with y into z by using the definition of commutator here this will become x inverse into z inverse into x z this term as it is commutator of x with y that is x inverse y inverse x y and this is z now again here z into z inverse that is identity so this will reduce to the form x inverse into z inverse into x into x inverse y inverse x y z again from here we can combine x into x inverse that will become identity so this expression becomes x inverse into z inverse into y inverse into x y z now z inverse into y inverse that is the inverse of element y z so we have obtained x inverse into the inverse of y z into x into y z now by definition of commutator this is a commutator of element x with y z so these were some of the commutator identities